how are these AirPods 2 Pro after one year of usage? Let's find that out in this video. Hey, what's up? It's always me, Johnny, and welcome to my new video. Today, as you could see from the intro, we're going to talk about the AirPods Pro second generation. This is a long term review, so this is almost after one year because I just received this as a gift uh, last year in the Christmas time, so it is almost one year. I know that somebody talked about already the newest AirPods 3 coming with the display, coming with other new features, but uh, I guess this will never happen, especially the display, because why adding a display on this? Uh, headphones because if you just use them they don't need a display for using these headphones in any way because you have all the controls in your airpods and for everything that you cannot do here you can do it on your phone that you will have probably at a minimum distance of few meters so why adding a display and also this will not be apple style i mean they will choose for sure a more uh, minimal design anyway talking about this design as you can see I use pretty much from the start this silicone case on the outside because uh, they tend to get a lot of scratches in these plastic cases. If you have these headphones, make sure to protect them with a silicone case or a leather case, whatever you like. They can just scratch very, very easily. But other than that, I mean, they are great, great design. They are very small, easy to open also with one hand and they are just light. You can take this anywhere and you cannot feel it pretty much while you're carrying this small case. Still the perfect headphones for me because they are really, really comfy. They fit very nice in my ears. And as I said, they are very light too because the headphones also are very, very, very light. And if they are comfy enough for you, you will not feel these headphones on you. And sometimes you maybe may even forget to have those headphones. Plus they have different size for the plastic tip right here. So the here tip, there are like four sizes, so pretty much for every ear. I mean, for somebody they will not fit like perfectly, but still they are one of the best that you can find on the market that will fit better in your ear. Sound quality is great. I mean, I tried better headphones with better sound quality, but they are uh, hover ear headphones and they are much bigger. They have more power and as I said, better quality, but as I said, they are over here. So they are bigger, they are heavier. And most of the time, I mean, they are also more expensive. As I was saying, the quality is good and plus some feature they give an advantage on most of the other headphones like for example the special audio that you can enable on this airpods 2 and more other smart feature that we will talk about later anyway these are very very smart headphones and with the time they've received a lot of updates especially with ios 17 like the adaptive sound so it can understand automatically where the headphones are and adjust between noise cancelling mode and transparency mode so for example if you are at home you are probably alone there are no significant noise around you it can use noise cancelling mode because you don't need to hear what's around you and otherwise if you are in the streets for example it will turn transparency mode on so you can be more aware of your surroundings and this is very very important and it's working very good so we just go into settings we select my airpod you just wear the headphones and then you can select adaptive mode very very easy also you can control this setting here on press and hold on airpods because as you can see if you press the left stem or the right stem you can just customize your controls and you can enable maybe adaptive mode i have only transparency and noise cancellation mode at the moment for both of the headphones because i don't need more features and for example i will talk about more this uh, adaptive mode and also the ability of these headphones to detect external noises. For example, when I'm walking in the streets with music on, I can hear perfectly a car from a hundred of meters thanks to these smart features. And you can hear really perfectly where it will come from by just a combination of lowering a bit your music and also by increasing the volume of the car noise. Just trust me, this feature is really, really great. So I use them a lot in transparency mode and I know that the noise cancelling on these headphones is great really. It's one of the best that I've tried at the moment. I use them pretty much all the time in transparency mode because 
I really like how it works and it feels very natural to have them with transparency mode and sometimes as I said in the, at the beginning I forgot that I have headphones I'm not kidding really really they are really comfy and so really often it happens that I forgot I have them on then I can say they are very resistant to shock because once I, I did drop one of the headphones from the stairs so it is like two three meters high and nothing happened they still works pretty good actually there wasn't any major problem they are really plasticky we can say but they are very resistant i tried it and i don't suggest you to try it also but i mean that still works so if you're looking for a good pair of headphones these are really really good indeed a little bit expensive yes but now you can find them at a, at a very good price especially in this time of the year and i really really use them every day for at least 10 hours a day and they don't bother me at all after i use them i just put it here in the case they just recharge them automatically very very easy and when i have to charge the case i just put them on the wireless pad and so it will charge everything together very very easy and convenient so this video was a little update and experience on my long-term review on this airpods pro second generation if you have any question just write me down below in the comments so i will be happy to answer to them also let me know if you had any problem any issues with this airpods pro 2 if you have one and if you are planning to buy one of those just let me know it i can give you some tips and tricks to use those so for the video that's pretty much it just hit a like button down below if you did like it and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already as always thank you for watching my video and i will see you in my next one bye for now